Aries, 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 Aries. Hello, Aries. How are you guys doing? Welcome to The Unspoken, okay? Formerly known as What Do They Not Tell You? So let's take a look at your person's unspoken desires, feelings, thoughts, whatever the freak it is, right? <laughs> um, Aries, please do not forget to hit the like button for me, please. Thank you guys so much. Um, you know, it only takes less than... Less than a second to just do it and hit like, you know? <laughs> also, Aries, if this does not resonate for you right now, it just may not be your message right now, okay? So check out your other placements, your moon, your rising, your Venus, okay? What other, other placements you may like to watch. So we're going to get started with the untold truths of the heart oracle. And then we're going to check in with the lunatics <laughs> by using the check-in true divine counterparts oracle. Okay, I will be pulling some angel answers cards, um, you know, the advice, whatever spirit wants to tell you about the situation. So let's see what we got. Aries. Aries person, unspoken truths and thoughts. Aries person, unspoken thoughts and truths. <laughs> Aries person, unspoken thoughts, feelings, desires. Aries, bottom of the deck is unconditional, okay? Innocence, support, whole heart. This person loves you unconditionally. They will always love you no matter what. Even if you guys can't be together or you don't want them, they love you no matter what, Aries, okay? All right. The love doesn't change for you, Aries. Aries person's thoughts, unspoken thoughts and feelings for them, please. Aries person, unspoken thoughts and feelings for them. Okay. Aries, you have masculine energy. Okay. Somebody may be involved, okay? Um, okay, this could be your divine masculine Aries if you believe in twin flames. But somebody here has masculine energy. Okay. The motherfucker's smoking on whatever he's smoking on. <laughs> Then you have distance, barrier, separation, and space. So they feel very distant from you or like you're you're growing dis distant from them. Kind of similar to Aquarius's reading. Bottom of the deck is mirror, reflection, shared feelings, and you. Kind of getting for some of you, this can be, um, you know, your twin flame. All right. Or at least your soulmate, right? Aries. Aries. Aries person, unspoken thoughts and feelings could be connected to a Capricorn. Aries person, unspoken thoughts and feelings. All right. Aries person, unspoken thoughts and feelings for them. Six of Swords in the reverse, Aries, they haven't moved on. They can't move on. It's hard. They're still struggling, okay? Some of you, this is someone who still um, is going through the aftermath of a separation, a divorce. If this is not your partner, right, um, they're probably going through a separation or a divorce, a recent breakup. So they may not be completely ready on an emotional and mental level for anything just yet. Um, with the Six of Swords in the reverse, they're still working through some baggage. All right. Aries person's current, oh, not current. Aries person's unspoken thoughts and feelings for them. Aries person, unspoken thoughts and feelings for them, please. Okay. Aries, you have the Four Swords reverse. So there could definitely be separation, barriers. Um, the world, the Wheel of Fortune reverse. We got a whole lot of major arcana here. You could be connected to a fixed sign, okay? So Taurus, Scorpio, Leo, Aquarius. Um, Taurus here again, okay? Some of you cannot be together because there is a religious factor, Aries or you know, um, some type of factor, okay? Maybe you guys work together and, you know, they don't they don't want to break the code or whatever. Um, this person wants to commit to you, Aries, I feel. Whoever this person is, they do want commitment from you. They do want that with you, okay? But 
it's the wrong time right now. They feel like it's not the right time. It's kind of like some people don't believe in it, but they feel like they met you at the wrong time, Aries. Okay. Um, this is like a big clock to me sometimes. You know, if it's in the reverse, this is stagnation. This is, you know, when you're you when you feel like you're in a stuck situation, stuck in a rut. This person is very stuck on you, Aries. Um, I feel like they do intend to come out of this separation with you. Obviously, the four swords is in the reverse. Maybe they need time to heal. They need time to think, okay? Um, if this is your partner, they needed some time to think. And they will be back, okay? With the Wheel of Fortune in the reverse. Something in this person's life may not be going the way they want it to right now. They may feel... As though they're unlucky in finances or love, whatever it is, it, it is a barrier. It is a barrier, Aries. The world is here. They feel like they want to give you the world. They do want to um, start over with you. They do, do plan to start over with you. That's what they don't tell you, okay? Some of you, this could be a move. Maybe they plan to move where you are, okay? Um, or they want you to move where they are, Aries, okay? But I just feel like um, there's something that is keeping this person, you know, kind of away from you right now. And for a lot of you, it's just because they are still working or still um, healing from something, Aries. For others of you, it, it may just be them feeling as though their life is kind of not going the way they want it to right now. Eight of Swords is in the reverse. So they do want to get out of their head, Aries. They do. And they will. Maybe fear has been keeping them away from you. But I feel like this is someone who wants to get out of something. If they're married, Aries, they do want to get out of their marriage. Okay. Um, they may be with this person for, like I said, um, maybe it could be financial reasons or just because, you know, religious reasons, family, something like that. Okay. Like I said, could be keeping you guys apart. The lovers in the reverse could be a Gemini, but there was a separation here. If this is your partner that you, you know, you guys separated from, I feel like they're still stuck on you. They're, it's, it's, they're unable to really move forward, Aries. Um, they keep thinking about what happened between you two. Okay. Um, you're probably done for some of you with this person, but they're not done. Okay. Um, the five of wands is here. Maybe before you guys broke up there was a very big fight okay but um i feel like they feel like this is still worth fighting for very interesting aries so let's see what they have to say aries. Okay. unspoken truth of aries persons thoughts feelings desires Unspoken truth of Aries person, thoughts, feelings, and desires. This person's stuck on you, Aries. I feel it. Well, the fortune reverse, they ain't going nowhere. They're stuck like Chuck. Um, and they want to get back together. They do. But maybe the timing just isn't right right now. Or they could be waiting for the green light from you. <laughs> but let's see what we got. We got stuck on you, see? I have tried to move on many times, but it has not worked. Nothing else is quite the same. So no matter what they do, they have not been able to move on, Aries. It may seem as though they have, but they have not. <laughs> They're still stuck on you. I have shed many tears over this and over you. They have cried over you. <laughs> Maybe this person's real masculine, real stubborn, real you know, set in their way so they don't show emotion, they don't show anything, but they, uh, um, they, they cry <laughs> over you, Aries. Will you just speak your truth? Maybe they want you to get things started. I want to talk to you, but I don't know what to say. Yeah. I cannot change you and I can't make you get it. I can only change myself. Anything else, Aries person, unspoken truth, Aries person, unspoken truth. <clears throat> they say soul connection. Sometimes I miss you so much, it hurts. 
they feel attached to you like there is a chain around you guys's neck and that's keeping you guys together even distance even though you guys are not together or apart whatever it is um they just feel so connected to you still i don't want to think about you or this so they try to block you they try to block you out aries all right let's see Advice for Aries in this love situation. Advice for Aries in this love situation. Advice. Some of you, this is definitely a twin flame connection, okay? You have success. I do feel like you guys will commit to each other, even no matter what it seems like right now. You guys will commit to each other. Of course, you don't have to if you don't want to. There's free will. But then you have yes. They will come back around to you. They will come back, okay? And I think with the world, you guys are going to start a whole new chapter. You guys are going to start completely over. Okay. That is what I have for you, Aries. I love you guys so much. Thank you for tuning in. See you guys next time.